Yo, what's going on, guys? Shake it back, back, and today you see it on the screen. 2K19, we throwing it back, baby, all the way back, bro. This feels like a lifetime ago. It is crazy to think this was literally like six, seven, eight months ago. It feels like it was like three or four years. Like, I don't know. Every time I jump back to like an older my team, it's like a crazy blast because I don't know, but my memory's so bad. But uh, I'm doing this because Carlos and me, Carl Store, we're going to do like a YouTube video. We've been meaning to go out for so long, bro. Um, but we're going to do something, I think, on 2K19 for a Throwback Thursday. Maybe, like, the next week or the week after that. But um, but it is Throwback Thursday today. So I was like, man, let me hop on my team. And I tweeted out last night. I was just like, I was, I was looking at some old tweets because the NFL draft was coming. I was like, bro, I remember when I was so mad the Patriots didn't draft Lamar Jackson. But long story short, I was looking at old tweets and I saw the Rage comp. And I was like, man, I want to go back on 2K19. So we re-downloaded it. We're here. We're going to check it out for the first time, bro. And this is going to be like a crazy trip down memory lane, man. I mean, I don't even know. Can we play this game? I don't even know. Are people playing this game online? Duh, someone might be. I might. We might We might take it online real quick. Oh, my goodness. I don't know. But let's just at least check out what there is. I do want to at least check out the stuff that's on here. And if maybe if you want me to play a game, maybe we do that. But let's at least for now just enjoy now get in the rage because you know this game caused a lot of rage bro oh my goodness but this game was bro I, I really did love this game this game was really good i think this was one of the better two games but it still had so many issues let's not act like it didn't the servers anytime new packs came out they, they were terrible for me for most of the year bro we had so many rage videos from just the servers man oh the stupid uh what's it called the schedule mode games oh these were terrible bro those were such a grind. I didn't even finish most of them, but we had to get the two cards, and that was to get to 10 games. I just noticed, too, we have 700,000 empty that we're just sitting on. And it's kind of funny, too, because when I looked at a screenshot from, like, literally one year ago that I posted on Twitter, it was the Pink Diamond KG that dropped in... Which packs was it? Oh, my goodness. I don't even know what they were called, bro. But uh, Pink Diamond KG, I think it would be Throwback Playoff Moments. Yeah, it was these ones. Where is KG? I see Dwight. There he is, KG. But this card came out a year ago. Bro, we just got a pink diamond KG a year ago. They really do be releasing the same stuff over and over and over. <laughs> um, but that KG this year was free. This one, you had to get in packs. So I guess that's a little bit better this year than versus last year. But I don't know. That was pretty cool. I, I think that, that was when it, that before this even like ramped up and we got all these crazy opals. Man, we were still getting like normal pink diamonds at this point last year. Now we're literally getting like cards with shaft to can shoot a hall of fame range extender bro uh whatever not range extender you know what it is i can't even remember is it range extender no it was range yeah limitless range so it is range extender now yeah so what the heck my brain ain't working but yeah i hit 8 million mt i think that was because we just got Giannis. and bro i feel like the collector levels were so much better this past year on 2k19 than they are this year even though if you look at them like they look so much better but yet, they were more, like, important, I feel like, on 2K19 compared to this year. But, I don't know. We're going to look at all that. But, let's yeah, let's check out the collector level. Because we did max this one out. And we got there pretty early, too. A rookie, some other stuff. This is all pretty much not the craziest. But, lo yo, this was such a good card, man. This was cheese. This was, like, the start of, I feel like, all the cheese last year. People got this card, and it was going crazy, man. Had that base 11. And, man, he was nasty. That card was really cool. Um, Chris Webber, it was okay. That card definitely didn't... I feel like it didn't make too much of an impact for me. J.R. Smith, though, that was wild when we got that. And then the Giannis. So, there's really not that many. Like, if you... On 2K20, there's, like, so many more. 750, all this stuff. But, like, I don't know. Because some of them weren't that great. And I feel like they're not as impactful as these cards were at the points that they were released, you know? Like, by the time Galaxy Opal AD is... Like, a lot of people got him, and I still haven't even gotten him. Like, because he's just not that important compared to... There's way better cards out there, I guess, you know? Um, but I definitely think the the corner, up in the corner here, that 2K20s looks better. And I don't even have 2K20s, like the Galaxy Opal look. But I think the card, like Galaxy Opal Glow, on these 19 cards, I think it looks cooler. I don't know. That's just me. Man, bro... Looking at the playoff moments and playoff packs, this makes me so sad. I think this card was about a year ago because this was like a first round card. Like some of these lower end cards, I think this one as well was a first round card because the Clippers didn't make it too far last year. Um, 
but like yeah th these were early round cards some of these lower end stuff too dj augustin that was a first round card Derek white i think yeah first round card so like those were right around this time last year man the first round was going on bro we got no basketball right now i know the world going through way more crazy stuff and more important stuff so i'm not trying to diminish that i'm just saying it's just crazy to think about that like there's no playoff this is like my favorite time of the year usually and man we got no playoffs that's that's sad bro that makes me literally i'm not kidding i could cry right now i am about to cry bro that's so sad no playoff basketball we're really not gonna get to see the finish season finish up i feel like man that's that's kind of depressing bro um as a sports fan that, that we get the draft tonight that's what we get to look forward to now the nfl draft that's it that is literally it and they're doing it on like zoom or some crap i don't even know man oh boy what else is in here bro we got the playoff okay these were the cards that dropped like over the summer and stuff which one of these was like the last cards they dropped like draymond no Dom i think dominique was pretty late they dropped him him and i think no big z i don't know if he was later because he already had a cheesy pick diamond i remember see i remember some stuff about this game but i don't remember a lot of it like, I remember what cards I liked, what cards I didn't like. This Penny Hardaway was pretty fun. I loved that card. Definitely did. Man, the Al Horf for that card stunk. I remember that. The JR meme, though. Why does his face look like he's crying? Like, that, that, that's the strangest picture, bro. But yet, this is such a cool card looking. Like, it's an iconic My Team card. DeMarcus Smart. That was about a year ago, too. So we did get, we got throw off, we got the throwbacks, and we got the current moments, bro. Obviously, they can't do current moments this year because, oh yeah, oh yeah, there are no games, as I just said, bro. I got all upset about I'm still upset about that. Bro, I like the way that they did moments better last year. I'm not going to lie. I like the moments of the week this year. That card was crazy. But, ah, uh, man. I don't know. Then, like, they, they, they randomly gave moments. I feel like the moments were too random this year. Like, like th now they just do the Spotlight Sims for people who like fake moments with cards and performances like ah, i don't know it's just weird it's not i don't know i definitely liked it better when obviously uh i don't know the moments were more consistent they were pretty dope last year these are all low low level cards too but uh some of these got some good burn these lebrons i remember when those came early in the year look at that no hall of fame badges to one hall of fame badge yet now all these cards have like 40 20 all these crazy numbers man the Aldridge was cheese. I remember that card. Jamal Crawford. I didn't use that card or these cards that much. Devin Booker got some good cards. This card was good, bro. And then, like, oh, even the promos. I liked, I'm not gonna lie, the Prime series. I liked the first one, but I, I really don't care for it anymore. Like, I, like they're doing Luka, Luka, I think, now was recently. I don't even know who's, who's the reward for this. That's the thing. We don't even know who the rewards are. We knew the rewards going into these, and yet... Even though Chris Paul kind of stunk, the who who were the other ones? Who were the other ones? I can't remember, man. Blake Griffin. I don't think that one was that crazy either. I think that that one actually was really good. I remember that. It just wasn't that much better than the. I think this pink diamond actually was better for me. I remember that aspect. And then that Shaq, which was like the cheesiest card ever. And Loki, this card might have started to ruin my team because then they figured out, oh, we can give Shaq a three ball, and <laughs> that people are just gonna accept it. I mean, I guess. I don't have a choice whether to accept it or not but oh man this set was cool man the paul george i loved this card in here the Kyrie, the rose i didn't like how they did that like the limited in this one i don't know that was weird too i remember that day it was really confusing when the packs came the signature series and kobe yo oh my goodness and lebron we really don't have a Kobe. I, I, I'm not getting those 300 games done, bro. I kind of accepted it. Like, like maybe one day I'll grind out a whole bunch of games, bro. But uh, let's check out my lineup. I'm probably not going to get those done. I'm going to keep it real with you, bro. Look at this team, though. Ben Simmons point guard. The original OG cheese card. That card was cheesy. We had to do some crazy set for that, didn't we? And we got Michael Jordan. These were the 99 all cards. LeBron, too. So wait, the only one I don't have is I think Kobe too, right? Bro, do they have him in the packs? What, what do they have in the packs? They got fan favorites. They got th throwback playoff moments, super pack moments. Jeez, these were the playoff cards. Yeah, I remember that. This, this is cool, man. They got a whole bunch of stuff. They got duo packs. I didn't re 
too many of these, I don't think. I think we might have done a couple, bro. It doesn't even say who's in these. I'm, I'm gonna rip some packs probably in a little bit here, just because why not? But I, I'm not gonna use all my empty because we, we're gonna do some videos with Carlos, so probably wanna save some of it. Um, bro, look at these. Oh, these have the Kobe, LeBron, and the Jordan in them. But those aren't the limited versions. Um, where is... We have 136 packs. There's no way this is... Oh, it's just crap. Oh, it's just triple the... Bro, ah, these packs are so bad. Like, I definitely don't like how these packs were, but low-key, the gold packs weren't the worst. Those moment, the regular packs were, but when we actually got, like, the diamond packs, bro, it was so... That was, like, such a good feeling. Man, triple threat, low-key, I always think the boards were better last year. Now, looking at this, were they really better? Because all pretty much all these packs was garbage, man. Like, th these packs was not good. A lot of these had injuries. Every now and then, they have badges. Contra, like, these were not good packs, but I feel like triple threat boards, though... They were a little bit more reliable last year, but the connection was so bad for me most of the time. Do I have anything good in here, or is it just all this? It's all this. That's literally garbage. I'm sitting on a lot of packs on 2K22, but I think it's not a lot of good stuff. What is this? It, uh, what, what is this black pack? What is that? I have no clue. It's uh, Ruby Coach. Okay. Um, definitely don't remember that, man. <sighs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> I don't remember any of this stuff, but there's nothing good in those packs. Damn, I thought there'd be something good in here. There's literally nothing good, bro. I did see. It was funny when I booted up this game. They, they're doing like a $20 deal where you can get a Legend Edition of 2K. A whole bunch of VC MT packs. Jeez, man. Like, that it didn't look like a bad deal. If you don't have... But then again, they gave away this game for free, didn't they? Wasn't this game like a dollar or something? Or, no, 2K20, I mean. So... Like, they were promoting it on 2K19. Like, if you didn't have it, they're giving you all kinds of crazy deals and stuff, bro. Um, what else do we want to look at? Look at my mic team again, bro. This Durant was pretty nice. Bro, I love that Jason Tatum, Paul George. Yeah, that car was crazy. Shaq. See, I wasn't even starting that Shaq either. Yao Ming felt like he was better last year. Dave Robinson, bro. It's crazy how good this car was. And yet, the Galaxy Opal, Dave Robinson in 2K20. I literally hate him. I literally would have liked to quick sell him, bro. Giannis was coming off my bench at the end of the year, bro, probably because I had 99s here. <laughs> and I wasn't really running the small forward at point guard. I think I may have run him off the bench. No, I was doing Tatum there. I think that was because I was trying to cheese my way to 12 and 0, bro, wasn't it? Dude, we still have the 11 and 1. That's crazy, right? Or no, is that 10 and 1? I don't even know. I think that's 10, yeah. That was when I shaved my head the first time. Yeah, yo, that's crazy. I'm not gonna lie, I'm glad we lost because I like that I shaved my head. Like, that was a cool thing. I always wondered. I was like, bro, I kind of want to shave my head, bro. I'm going to go bald eventually. And, yeah, I don't know. I, I, I actually really like it. I'm not going to kind of like I really like it, bro. It's nice having, like, a smooth head. And, I don't know. And, again, I was losing my hair, but it was getting pretty thin up there. So, it's kind of nice, man. I don't know. I think I look like a badass, too. The beard. I like the beard, too. So, that was a nice change, bro. That's something, like... I look so different compared to back then. My goodness. Maybe that's why it feels like it was a lifetime ago. Oh, my goodness. Bro, let's open up a couple packs. I don't even know what to open. Okay, wait. We can't even open these? These are VC only? Wow, that's crazy, bro. Damn, wait. They got all the packs. Oh, damn. Look at all the... Oh, I remember those. Those were the throwbacks. <laughs> those are funny. Wow, damn. Ah, I, I, I like the format a lot better with the... um. The throwback cars and the elites. I don't know. It was kind of like you kind of knew what was coming and when. Man, these are all VC only, bro. What? I want to open up these packs, fam. Those are crazy dope. Those got a lot of opals. Heat check. Oh, I want to open those. Generation next. The draft packs. Those were kind of cool, man. Huh. But but dynamic. Okay, so probably dynamic duos are the packs that you'd want to open. Twelve thousand a pop. What do these have? One guaranteed dynamic duo card. Can we quickly pull a Galaxy Opal? Oh, no, that's a diamond. Bro, I just like the way the cards shake around in this, too. Like, this seems way more satisfying to me. I don't know. I, I, I like it a lot better. Was this Danny Granger or something? Probably. I think he's the only Pacer boy I remember. Uh, oh, I will never, ever forget. I, I'll forget plenty of things. I, I've, 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 I've forgotten my own birthday before, too. Like, when I, when I signed for my Mustang, I definitely wrote down the wrong birth, like, the wrong date of birth. I wrote down, instead, my birthday is May 26th. I wrote down May 24th. I don't even know why. I had to go back and fix the paperwork. That was really embarrassing. Oh, uh, that was funny. But, um, I'll never forget 
Danny Granger missing that shot at the buzzer with the full bar in overtime. Here you go, he's open! Danny Granger! What? Are you fucking kidding me? What? Oh my god, this game sucks! What? Oh my god, this game sucks so bad! Oh my god! Are you fucking kidding me? This game is so shit! To win me the game, that was great. Was it in overtime? I don't know if it was in overtime or regular. I think it was... Might have been overtime, or maybe it was regulation. I don't even know, bro. Um, probably should just quick sell it, but that, bro, oh, man, he sold for me so bad that one time. I'll never forget that. I feel like you never forget the times that cards sell for you, but you don't remember the times they hit big shots really that much. What else we got? We got fan favorite packs. It's got Opal Granger. I don't even know. I don't think I used that card that much. I didn't use this Porzingis as much as I used the, was the Amethyst, I think, this year? That card was one of my favorite cards of 2K in a long time, bro. I'm mad that we can't open the Signature Series. That's, but then again, wait, do they have duos? Oh, they do. So they're in the Dynamic Duo Packs then. I assume <laughs> they should be. Can we just rip a quick Galaxy Opal real quick? I just want to get one. That would be really cool. I mean, there's got to be one. We got so much empty. There it is! Second pack, baby! Quick Galaxy, oh wait, there's like a ton of them though. Who could this be? Spurs, that's probably Tim. No, Tony Pro. Yo, is it really Tony? <laughs> that's got me the worst one. <laughs> oh, bro. We might have to do another pack. That was kind of, that was kind of a letdown. <laughs> Damn, bro, that's gotta be, that's kind of tough. <laughs> Oh my goodness, man. These packs are pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, these dynamic duos. I don't know. I like the way the content revved up in 2K19. How, like, we weren't forced to use opals, like, too early on. Is this an opal? Ah, oh, ruby. I saw a color, but it's only a ruby card. Rick Schmitz. That is historic. Damn, bro. Those cards literally got wiped out. They don't even do historics anymore. I like the historics, though. They were good collection fodder, man. And I don't know. I, there were so many things about this game I liked, but then, again, I, I'm sure if I think really hard, I can find the bad things again. Just like the lag that I was facing. Like, there was, it was weeks at a time where I wouldn't be able to play because the servers were so messed up my inner connection. That's how Comcast players are, I think, being done right now, bro. I know there's people that can't even play 2K20 because they said they got Xfinity or Comcast or whatever. And the internet, it's it, it just not letting them connect to 2K. Ooh, wait, that one right here. Funny story, too. Uh, this is just a random video, bro. We are dragging on. Not really funny. Just coincidence that I posted the KG video. And then later that night, yesterday, they had the 2008 finals on on ESPN. Um, we're just going to quick sell you, Ray. Sorry. But I just thought that was really funny. I was like, wait, the, the, they got the finals showing on ESPN? Like, that's so weird. Because uh, we made the KG video. But I don't know. Random. All right, let's do a few more, bro. We got lucky with Opal, but Tony Parker, though, come on, man. You go. I don't even, it don't even matter, but Tony Parker, though, that's how you're going to do me. All right, look at this pack of luck. It ain't, it ain't too fire right now. Pulling a bunch of amethyst. This is Kawhi, shooting guard. That's Vince Carter, right? Oh, yeah. Bro, Vince Carter, when he dropped, was pretty dope, too. I remember that card. I didn't like that one as much as I liked the other ones. The other ones were really dope. The limited, oh. The limited cards were pretty cool, too. When you pull the limited, it was really cool. My favorite pack opening, though, I think, from all of my pack I've done in a while, it was the Kevin Durant, whatever it was, the, the Uno card. Because I remember we pulled him, and then didn't we pull him, like, back to back? Which was, that's really crazy. That, that was, or it was in the same box or whatever. I don't know. That card went for a ton, too. I sold them for a ton. We had, we had 8 million MT, bro, after we sold all the stuff back. There's no way, I, like, I haven't seen anyone with that much MT Galaxy open the same spot. In uh, 2K20, I feel like. I don't know. Maybe maybe it's just there's not that many, like, cards that have that much value. But another... Is this really another Tony Parker? No, that's power forward. That's going to be Timmy Duncan, bro. I was going to say, another Tony Parker, man. <laughs> I don't know. But um, this is pretty cool, man. I do miss... I miss 2K19. There was some good vibes. Let me know in the comment section your favorite memory from 2K19. Whatever was, like, a video of mine you watched. Favorite card you pulled in a pack, a game winner, a buzzer beater, a 12-0, man. We went 12-0 three times last year. We haven't caught it a single time this year. And I'm not gonna lie, I would be fine with... I'd be fine going the rest of the year without going 12-0, bro. It's it's way more stressful now than it was last year. And it was so stressful last year, we shaved the head from it, damn near. 
it was pretty bad, but um, I don't know. I, just, I don't like it this year, man. It's, it's so sweaty. Oh, my goodness. Where is the um the 12 and 0 cards, bro? Here they are, right here. We got the Finley, the Ginobili, the Hakeem, and we came close to Jason Richardson. And we lost in the final game multiple times from some crazy stuff, too. When I was watching the Rage video, I saw that, too. So that was crazy. Like, we should have got another couple of these cards, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. I say it, Thomas. <sighs> Didn't want that card really that much last year either. <laughs> There's some pretty cool sets, but I mean, these are pretty much the same cards we get still. Like Carmelo, March Madness cards. We got a couple of these other cards, I think, for whatever they did this year. We've gotten a few Yao Mings. He got a pink diamond. He got an opal now. A lot of these cards, we we have some of these, but not all of these. We don't have a lot of these, actually. And some of these we already got like early in the year. Like this was the first opal in the game, damn near. That's a cool looking card, man. I love the glow. It looks it looks way better, I feel like, um, last year than it does this year. I don't know. The card art is definitely better this year. But, like, I look at the sides. The sides and the smoke and everything and the glow. It looks so cool. I don't know, man. Yeah, maybe. I feel like, though, if I did this... No, nah, I definitely wouldn't. If I did this in 21, I'm not going to come back to 20 and be like, yeah, this was the best. I'm definitely not going to do that. But I feel like if I did this a lot of years, you're going you're gonna to think more fondly of it when you come back to it. But... Pretty dope stuff, man. And the heat checks, bro. <sighs> These were so irrelevant. They're still irrelevant, man. They, they gotta scrap that idea, bro. They gotta scrap it. It's so, so irrelevant. Like, they're, they're, the resources are being wasted on whatever that is, man. They could do way better things with just getting rid of that. Not focusing on that, bro. There is token cards, too. I mean, we had 10 Galaxy Opals from there. A lot of the Iverson that we grinded for. The Scal, I think I brought that with my leftover tokens after we bought these, didn't we? But I don't even know if I play with that card, man. I'm going to keep it real with you. I may have, it says zero for all mine because my stats got reset, which sucks. I like looking at my stats and seeing how many games we played. But yeah, uh, we got shoes, hella shoes, bro. How we, we've been playing my team for like a million years and we still can't just A, quick sell all our shoes, bro. <laughs> like, or a stack of shoes. And then the badges, man. Looking at the badges and everything. Like, just the thing that we are able to add badges. I like that system. I'm not gonna lie. I don't really like that we can't add badges. Because then it relies 2K and the position locks. There were some changes I don't love about 2K20. I don't know. I feel like certain things just... They don't gel with me. But I think y'all already know that. And I'm not really trying to complain. I'm just giving my thoughts, my opinions. And stuff like that, man. I really enjoyed 2K19. I think a lot of people did, bro. Look at these lineups. These lineups are crazy. LeBron, we got the Kings lineup. I remember Rage quitting with this team. They were not very good. I don't know why. They look good, but they were not very good to play with. This team is crazy. My goodness. There were some cool teams. But I don't know. That's uh, and Triple Threat Online, man. We were running with Popo, Giannis, and Durant. Oh, my goodness, man. But I don't know. I don't think there's anything else really to look at. Domination. The rewards weren't that crazy. Yeah, the rewards kind of sucked, bro. The rewards definitely, I think, were better this year. But I... Even that Jason Richardson Opal, bruh. Nobody's using that right now. Maybe someone is. We wasted a lot of time grinding on that. But that is pretty much it, man. That's 2K19. I mean, I don't know if I even... Oh, I wish I had enough to buy this card. That's the Galaxy Opal Limited Kobe, bruh. Ah. Oh, I remember I was torn between which two of the three to get. And oh, I could not get Kobe as well, man. Those cards were so expensive. That's why we had all the MT probably because of the limiteds and all kinds of other crazy cards, man. Like, those don't even exist now, bro. Those cards sold for millions, bro. They always, them, them joints was crazy. Um, but that's it. I just wanted to come down memory lane. I don't know how long this video was based on what I edited and what I didn't. But pretty cool stuff, man. I, I want to open up more packs. I really do. <laughs> Pack Junkie Shake over here wants to open up some more. I mean, it's just kind of cool when you get the Galaxy Opal Glow, bro. But uh, this probably should be our last pack. Can we walk it off with a... Okay, with a pink diamond. Look at the pink diamond glow. It just feels so much better than this year, man. Pink diamonds actually had, like, importance. I feel like they don't this year. Is this Kevin Durant? Oh, it, it definitely is. Small forward. Yeah, dude. Don't tell me this is... What? That one? Oh, that's too cool. I didn't know you could pull that out of these. But this was, like, my favorite card, bro. This was... That was my favorite card to pull last year, too. That pack opening. I'm gonna go back and watch that video after this. That video was really cool. Then we pulled him and then we pulled. I freaked out. I remember that day, bro. And I. Ooh, ooh, whoa! We're pulling pink diamonds like crazy, bro! We're pulling multiple pink diamonds in multiple boxes! Come on, show me small forward! Yeah, baby! Let's go!
There it is! That's the card for the Galaxy Opal, bro! Pax is juicy right now. I'm gonna keep ripping. I usually stop when we pull, like, the card we're going for. But why would we stop? We're pulling two pink diamonds in a box back to back. Bruh, but there's KD. Sweet man. Yo, packs are juicy right now. Bruh. Bro, what? Up another. There's a third pink diamond in a box. Bro, I literally just tweeted. OMG, as we pull it. No, no, don't do it. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. That's a good way to end it, man. Even I can't believe that. Even though it's a pink diamond, that's a cool card. That card, I remember that card so vividly and everything about that. But certain things I don't even remember. I don't remember what I had breakfast yesterday. But yeah, let me know what you thought of this video. Um, like, we'll, maybe we'll do some. Maybe we'll play a game on this. I don't know, man. Um, we'll definitely do a throwback video. I think with Carlos soon, probably on his channel, probably on mine, probably both. I don't even know, man. We've been trying to do a collab for like freaking eight million years here. <laughs> So, yeah, maybe we'll do some Lakers-Celtics thing, too. I know he tossed that idea around to me before. And so, I don't know. Um, but, yeah, that is that. is that. that is a little look back at my team, 2K19. Um, bro, I, I have to link, like, up in the corner. I think there's a card or something. The Rage video that it was about a year ago. You got to watch that. That video is a classic, bro. That's, that's one of my favorite videos I've made. That video is hilarious, bro. But it's still missing some of it. So, I think there might be a part two. I think I did, because... It doesn't have that shot where Boo Painter hit like a half court three with Ben Simmons or whatever. And I was like, bro, are you serious? They were like, he was killing me and they were giving him that. Have fun playing a pro 2K player. But that's it. Hope you guys did enjoy. Little trip down memory lane. Just something, yeah, that I just, that was fun. I enjoyed that, man. So, I don't know. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll keep this installed in our PlayStation 2, especially how long it takes to freaking download. Oh, my God. If you're going to re-download this, just beware. It takes about a million years to copy the game. So, yeah, you're going to be sitting there for a while. But that's that. Hope you guys did enjoy. Leave a like. And, yeah, maybe we'll be back on another Throwback Thursday with this. Peace, man.